So today we're on our way to Whittier and we're going to hike the Portage Lake Trail, correct? I believe that is correct. Yes. All right, let's do it. Another Squatch Dog adventure. this tunnel and then there's another tunnel that we need to take that is only open every half hour for 15 minutes because um, it shares a road with the other side and a train so we're gonna have to time this one just right so apparently there is a toll buses trucks motorhomes trailers and boats we qualify wouldn't you say I had toll to go through this tunnel. So we have to wait in line in order to go through this tunnel. The cars from the other side are coming through right now and then we can go through it around 1030. And it costs 13 bucks to go through this tunnel to get to Whittier. All right, so it's our turn to go through the tunnel. So this tunnel is shared with a train and cars on the other side that are coming the other way. So they can only, on the top of the hour, traffic comes the other way. On the bottom of the hour, traffic goes in this way. And that's what we're doing right now. We're going in to Whittier. Kind of feels like we're going into a mine. We're turning in here to do the Portage Pass Trail. To look at the Portage Glacier from high above. Look at that glacier. Here we go, Portage Pass. One mile and then two miles to the lake. So four miles round trip. Riker is leading the way. He's our trailblazer. Lots of salmon berries growing along this trail. Starting to blossom. Really pretty. Are we gonna be going over the snow right away? Looks like it. All right. Hopefully not all the way. Yeah. All right, here we go, onto the snow. is straight up we're gonna do an elevation gain of 700 feet in a mile turn around and there's a cruise ship in Whittier Bay
to the top of Portage Pass, 800 feet. Now we'll go look for the glacier. waterfalls through here. Portage Glacier on Portage Lake. Well worth a hike. They've got boat tours that'll take you to the glacier. Taking a little bit of a break. A boy and his dog. Sounds like the train's getting ready to go through the tunnel. Now we're heading back down to the van. It's a good hike. What'd you think? Oh, well worth it. Yeah. It was a really nice hike, hard hike. It was really hard hike. It was steep. It was like no switchbacks. Straight up. We saw the glacier. And we saw the glacier in the lake, which was cool. So let's go get some lunch. I woke up in there. Me too. I'll make some grilled cheese sandwiches. We are heading into the town of Whittier and we are going to be competing with the boat crowd as we head to some of the shops today. This is a busy looking town. There's lots of cars here. This is pretty much the town of Whittier. It's a cruise ship stop. Not much here, except for a few restaurants. That's about it. This is Billings Glacier, right out of Whittier. This is our campsite for the night, overlooking Billings Glacier and some waterfalls outside of Whitty. And we've got this beautiful waterfall that's just raging right behind us. Check out all of these waterfalls that are dumping into the bay. We'll be looking at those tonight. And there's Billings Glacier right across the way. And best of all, once again, it's boondocking, so it's free. So today we got some shrimp in Whittier. That's kind of what they're known for. So I'm making some shrimp pasta. And then we're also going to take some of these shrimp and throw them on the barbecue and have them that way as well. So this should be a good dinner tonight. Oh yeah, that looks good. And so from Whittier Bay, we say good night and uh, sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Cheers. Cheers. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Give us a thumbs up and uh, happy trails. Tonight's camping spot with blue glacial waters. 
and the wonderful, beautiful Billings Glacier right over there. And all of these beautiful waterfalls all along the river. 